this quilt was an inspiration of our, what we call a, a song line of our trip to Australia. And we tried to focus on the Aboriginal, uh, the different things, the Aboriginal culture and uh, the colors and uh, just the sheer expanse of that country because it is a big country. And I was determined when I was in Alice Springs is to go to this quilt shop that specialized in Aboriginal designed quilts. And I ended up buying $500 worth of quilts that I, uh, material that I had to carry for the next four weeks with me. But uh, the lady, when I left the shop said, uh, I can close the doors now because I've made my quota for the day. Anyway, the quilt uh, represents kind of our journey. Uh, there was a couple of design elements I wanted to capture. The first one being is I wanted the quilt to to look like it was Aboriginal in its uh, design and style. And the second thing I looked for was to try and flow the colors through the overall quilt, blending it from one color into another color. And the dark border sort of contrasts everything. And if you look carefully at the quilt, those familiar with Australia, you can see that it really is a map of the eastern half of Australia with Uluru in the uh, in the center. Now Uluru is very, very sacred to the Aboriginal people. They are now the traditional owners of, uh, of the land there and uh, they have taken uh, uh, taken it back from, I guess, what can I say, the early settlers. And uh, things like climbing Uluru, which was a common uh, pastime, is no longer allowed. So it, it is a very sacred place. And you can see things like teaching caves, uh, where the uh, original Aboriginal uh, designs are, have been drawn on the rocks and all that. Uh, we spent a lot of time on what Australians refer to as the outback. And it's quite a desolate piece of landscape and uh, it was a rough journey. Um, anyway, I don't, I don't know what more to say. It's, uh, I tried to have fun with this quilt. I tried not to take it too seriously when I was pu putting it together. And uh, it is a, it's kind of a family heirloom for us now. Anyway, I think I'll uh, leave it at that. Uh, I can highlight on some of the things uh, uh, the snake, uh, the, the serpent at uh, the bottom right, the bottom center represents the Outback Trail uh, mm. going down into Melbourne, the city of Melbourne and wine country. Up in the top corner within the square, the top left corner are the, uh, what is referred to as the Seven Sisters, which is a, a star cluster in the Southern Hemisphere, which again is quite, uh, quite important to uh, the culture of the uh, indigenous people of Australia.